All right. Okay, guys. This is my wonderful wife, Jamie. My name is TJ. We are Vertical Journey Martial Arts. Uh, we founded Vertical Journey Martial Arts in uh, 2017, right? 2017. Yes. So it's been um, a little over two years now. It was um, early fall, which we're just getting to like real fall weather here. So that's kind of confusing at this point. But it was it was uh, September of 2017 when we really got started initially. Um, we wanted to take a few minutes just to go over our mission statement and kind of tell you guys what we're really about here. Um, we're not just a uh, martial arts school. We're not just here um, to teach some cool moves. Uh, we have a deeper mission um, and a bigger, a bigger goal that we're aiming at. So, Jamie, would you mind reading that for me? I'll read it. Vertical Journey Martial Arts exists for the purpose of helping people reach a higher personal potential by guiding them to become more confident and capable. We aim to provide a platform from which to glorify God and to spread his love to the local community. So that pretty much encapsulates what we're trying to do. Um, the vision is much bigger than that. And the way we do that um, encompasses martial arts training, self-defense training, helping out local charities, and partnering with other local um, businesses that reach out to the community. So there's a, there's a much bigger vision here than just, um, just those few sentences. But that's really our mission. That's, that's kind of the the small version of what we do. And um, the reason that we do those things is because we are believers in Christ and we think that he's called us as Christians to show his light to the world. And two of the main scriptures that um, we built that mission statement off of are uh, 1 Peter 2.17, which is honor all people, love the brotherhood, fear God, and honor the king. And that's been my life verse for a pretty long time, actually. Um, something that, that kind of guides how I make decisions on a daily basis, whether that be at home with my family or in the church or at work, uh, any of those things. It's, it's what helps me to choose what I do in my life. Um, and I think in some ways, Jamie can kind of say the same. She has her own life verse. Um, but do. do you remember it? Of course I remember it. Philippians 3, 7, and 8. And it's just basically saying whatever we do, we put it, uh, our accomplishments go behind us, and we are focusing towards our goal, which is to glorify God and to attain that. So it Sorry. fits along with our mission <laughs> as it does. well. It does. <laughs> so, so they kind of work hand in hand. They mesh really well. Um, the other verse that um, really came to mind when I was working to – to develop this mission statement initially was Matthew 5, 16, which is, let your light so shine before men that they will see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. Um, we want this to be a place where people can come and see God's love. We are not um, mission focused. We're not out there trying to, um, to win every soul that comes in the door. That's not what we're about. But we definitely want you guys to know, if you come into our dojang, that if you have questions about God, if you're struggling with something in life, you can come and ask one of us or one of our other instructors um, that we may have down the road, and, mm -hmm. and we can have a conversation about that. Be and, happy to pray for you. Yeah, we'll be happy to pray for you at any time. Yep. yep. So that's kind of what we're about here, and um, we hope that you guys can see that in the way we operate, and uh, we ask that you guys would kind of hold us to that encourage us and pray for us as we continue down this mission. Do you have anything else to add? Nope. I'm good. Awesome. All right. Thanks for listening. <laughs>